introduction another one is another one is now here software installation now here software installation one is inter introduction another one is now software installation another one is now software installation now software installation another one is another one is another one is maven project structure 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 another one is another one is another one is now here what is okay, importance of pom.xml importance of pom.xml importance of pom.xml importance of pom.xml another one is another one is dependency management dependency management another one is dependency management dependency management another one is another one is okay examples okay, different examples now here examples on okay examples on jar where form and some plugins now here plugins the plugins now next one is now next one is now next one is now next one is now here now next one is now next one is now here see what is the types of repositories no types of repositories no types of repositories no types of repositories no next one is no next one is importance of setting.xml importance of setting.xml no setting.xml no next one is no next one is maven scopes scopes how many scopes are there in maven maven scopes maven scopes now next one is now next one is now plugins now plugins now plugins now plugins maven plugins now next one is one jar application one jar application one jar application one jar application now next one is now next one is now next one is now here summary summary the syllabus syllabus in maven now first to we are going to see introduction okay introduction okay now here see introduction for every project for every project here see introduction for every project in your real time we have different phases are there one is analysis phase another one is design phase 
another one is build phase another one is testing phase another one is production phase here for every project okay in our real time we have analysis 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 design design build build design build now here testing and production is there design now build build now production is there now testing and production is there now here first now here first project will be started in analysis after that okay, it will move to design after that okay, it will move to build phase in build phase according to the client requirement according to the client requirement developer okay, developer will develop so many dot java files here now in build phase according to the client requirement developer has now here develop so many dot java files here so many dot java files here so many dot java files here see now here according to the client requirement i may write i may write one okay, so many dot java files here this is called source code here see here you cannot deploy this class files into your server because see every app server will have jvm jvm understand only byte code means dot class file compulsory you need to convert your dot java files into okay dot class files here okay dot class here you need to convert this okay now here dot java files into okay dot class here okay, dot java files into dot class here now here see now okay next one now here in your real time okay if you are working on the project see compulsory one class file will be depending on another class here that means we need to group of the you now classes here you now group of the dot class files is called jar here now jar 1 now jar 1 now you should do jar 2 so many so many jars are available jar 2 now jar 3 now jar 4 so many jars are available here jar 1 jar 2 jar 3 jar Four. now here now next one now here see okay if you want to deploy your application into your server compulsory either you should prepare var file or you should prepare er file here then only your server can able to understand it is a okay, it is a web application by reading app.xml file your server will be able to okay now now here process the request here means you need to prepare the var file now here group of jar files is called var files here now group of var files is called er file here er file here if it is big big enterprise application then we should go for er if it is normal application like micro service application we should go for var files here now here see first for every project now here first you need to write the source code okay you need to write the source code now here convert this source code into dot class file by using java c command by using java c command now here group of now dot class files is called jar group of no dot class files is called jar here jar here 
A dot jar file may have n number of dot class files are available. A group of jar files is called where here. Group of now here jar files is called where here. Now group of now here where files is called now now here here. Okay. Now first now here developer now here developer first now here develop the code. This is called now here source code. Okay. Source code now here. After that he will apply the compilation. Now compilation. How to compile? How to compile? Now compilation means by providing command or tool is called Java C. Java C file name dot Java. Whenever this statement will be executed, your dot Java files will be converted into dot class files here. Now after that, okay. After that, now here you need to generate the jar here. How to generate the jar here? There is a command is called jar jar iphone iphone xvf iphone xvf now here file name dot jar here. How to generate the where or er files here? Same story here. Now here how to generate the where means jar xvf not xvf cvf cvf now file name dot where now cvf now file name dot where here now here file name dot where here now here file name dot where here okay now here see now how to Generate the ER file. Generate ER. Now story will be same here. Now here <coughs> jar 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 iPhone CVF file name dot ER. Now file name dot ER here. Okay. Now we are done. Now we are okay. Now here developer all these steps is doing manually before introducing this build tools the developer all these tools are using all these you know, steps will use manually here. Assume that after deploying your ER file into your server now you got null pointer exception you got number format exception you got file not found exception in this now assume that you got identified that so and so dot java file okay now here so and so file now in this okay in this dot java file you are getting okay exception you are getting exception now what you will do okay immediately you should okay now here now here you should open that dot java file and you should fix that issue or not see whenever you will okay never you will fix that issue then compulsory you need to recompile the dot class okay whenever you will recompile the dot class compulsory you should regenerate the jar if you are not regenerate the jar old jar is there old jar is pulling old dot class old dot class is getting old source code of your project Whenever, even though you have 100 classes, whenever one small class of source code will be modified, compulsory you need to recompile, regenerate jar, var, and er. You should do that. See here, development time is only for 5 to 10 minutes time, but you know, this process, right? This other than the development process. Okay, it will take a minimum 10 to 15 minutes time open your command prompt to use that generate jar where and er okay it will take so much of time here to avoid this now here java guys has introduced some build tools okay java guys has introduced some build tools here what are the build tools here see here because of these problems to improve developer productivity to improve developer productivity now here you are java guys has introduced some build tools now here 
what are the build tools are there what are the build tools are there one is and 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 another one is maven maven one is and one is and another one is maven maven another one is another one is gradle 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 maven is equal and to plus some extra futures and to plus some extra futures that's why most of the real time are using maven gradle is completely different it is now here it is most of them suitable for our android uh, based application to understand this gradle now here you should need some groovy script okay gradle is completely written on groovy script see to understand this you know gradle first you should learn groovy like how javascript is there the, there is a scripting language is called groovy see that's why industry now here this maven is no one will use but most of the projects are using okay and no one will use most of the projects are using maven here now here maven here now here 80 percent of the projects are using maven old projects legacy projects old projects are still developed in and now clients are migrating from and to maven here because maven so many advantages are there i will have okay i will explain all these advantages here okay now here now we'll do what is maven now what is maven what is maven here now we'll do what what is maven maven now here maven is a build tool what is maven what is maven maven now here step one it is build tool it is build tool it is build tool maven is a build tool using maven now here maven provides maven provides maven provides to generate generate now maven provides now step one it compile the compile the source code now compile the source code after compile the source code it will generate jar where comma er after that what still maven will do jar where and here after that maven will do the deployment also now now here deploy your jar into some place okay, deploy your where into some place maven will do automatically now next one maven will generate the reports M maven will generate generate the reports okay, reports like okay, reports like code quality now here reports like code quality now here reports like now here code coverage code coverage and so on all will do and also maven will do generate the documentation of the project the documentation of the project everything maven will do you 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 no need to worry now here using all these commands and manually here fraction of seconds it will generate the jar where er and okay okay everything to us whatever requirement is this you need to inform to maven hey maven i need jar maven will give fraction of seconds jar to you I, okay same as where and er okay understood right now how to do now how to do <coughs> now how this maven will do i will explain now this is importance of maven here okay hope you are clear okay up to now clear or any questions you can ask me okay i will explain hope up to here clear okay this is introduction about maven here